creer en sí mismo. Creer en sí mismo. Huh, this is a longer phrase. What does this mean? Creer en sí mismo. This means to believe in oneself. This is used in, you know, if you want to say believe in yourself, you can do it. Or uh, when you feel like you don't believe in yourself, I mean, uh, you should not think like that. You should always believe in yourself. Uh, but, you know, this phrase is about that. Creer en sí mismo. To believe in oneself. So, for example, I can say, Tienes que creer en ti misma. Tienes que creer en ti misma. This means you have to believe in yourself. <coughs> um, so, mismo can change. Mismo or misma. Mismo masculine. Mismo right here. Masculine. Misma feminine. Okay? So, creer en sí Well, we have it right here. Creer en ti misma. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, si can change, okay? This can change. This can also change. This depends if it's masculine or feminine. And this one changes to, um, to different pronouns, okay? So when talking about yourself, When talking about yourself, you will be using ti misma or mismo. Creer en ti mismo. Believe in yourself. Creer en ti misma. Same thing. Believe in yourself. The first one is masculine. The second one is feminine. So when you say, when you say this, tienes que, you're saying, Tú tienes que, we don't need tú, and that means you have to, tienes que, you have to, creer en ti misma, believe in yourself. Okay, so this is a very, very positive thing to say to someone. So yeah, you can use um, ti when you want to say yourself, okay? Um, now, when you're saying, for example, uh, tienes que creer en, tienes, you can say tengo, let's change this to something else, so you know how we can uh, change this phrase really easily. You can say yo tengo, we don't, we just need tengo, need to use tengo, uh, hang on, let me just, erase all of this so tengo que creer en mí mismo en mí mismo so that means I I have to believe in myself okay So that's a different phrase there. Uh, we changed ti with me, okay? And obviously, um, this is masculine too. Um, you can say it in a feminine form. So you can say, tengo que creer en mí misma, okay? So I think I have to believe in myself, okay? So now, if you want to say, uh, Like them, for example. Ten, uh, tienen, ustedes tienen. We don't need ustedes. Okay. And that means you, plural, you know, it's you're talking to a group. You have to, tienen que creer en ustedes mismos okay let me just fix that really quickly tienen que creer 
en ustedes mismos. And that means you have to believe in yourself. Plural. Okay? You have to believe in yourself. Tienen que creer en ustedes mismos. Okay? So, very interesting. You can say that to yourself. Tengo que creer en mí mismo. Or to someone, singular. Tienes que creer en ti mismo. Okay? Or to a group of people. You can say that to a group of people and you have to say tienen que creer en ustedes mismos. When you use ustedes, uh, you need to use mismos because if it's a mixed group, men and women, and um, you can say that, you know, just the, you can use the uh, masculine form. If it's a group of females, then you can say, tienen que creer en ustedes mismas, okay? So it can be plural too. And that means the same thing. You have to believe in yourself, okay? So very interesting for sure. Uh, you can also say, uh, ellos tienen que creer en ellos mismos. We need this one here. We don't need the first ellos. Ellos tienen. Okay. Ellos tienen. So that means they have to believe. Tienen que creer en ellos mismos. Ellos mismos. Ellos is masculine. And it means in this situation, ellos means they. But... Hang on. Themselves, okay? In this situation, that means ellos mismos means themselves, okay? So that's another way to say ellos mismos themselves. You need to add ellos mismos themselves, okay? Not just ellos. Uh, tienen que creer en ellos mismos. They have to believe in themselves. If it's, uh, if you want to say they feminine, then just change this to A, to the letter, change, uh, add the letter A, replace the letter O with the letter A. Tienen que creer en ellas mismas. They have to believe in themselves. Okay, so that's something important to remember for sure. Now you know that this phrase can be flexible. You need to change uh, some things, pretty much the end of the phrase. Si mismo, yo mismo, tu mismo, uh, ti mismo, uh, and ti mismo, sorry, not tu mismo, ti mismo, um, and so on. Okay, so let's look at the next example. The next example is, no puedo creer que Miguel... Dijo que no cree en sí mismo. Okay? So, hmm, what does this mean? This means I can't believe Miguel said he doesn't believe in himself. Okay? Interesting. Interesting. Now, let's break this down. No puedo creer is a very common phrase. That means I can't believe that, that, that. Okay, I can't believe that, that, that. And uh, remember that because <laughs> it's very useful in Spanish. A lot of people say, no puedo creer, I can't believe. Okay? Que, remember, when using the verb que, it's very common to, you know, use also the, um, the word que, creer que. No puedo creer que Miguel, Miguel, dijo, él dijo, past tense, said, this comes from the verb decir, which means to say, 
Dijo que, that's another important thing, uh, when using the verb decir, uh, and if you want to add more to the sentence, you most of the times you will have to use the word que, okay? Dijo que, said that. That's pretty much what you're saying. No cree, él no cree en sí mismo. He doesn't believe in himself. Sí mismo means himself, itself, okay? So, that's important to remember. Sí mismo, I think we missed that one here. Then, um, for example, I can say él. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> just like that. Él tiene, we don't need él, but we can have it. Él tiene que creer en sí mismo. Okay? So that means he has to believe, he has to believe in I uh, missed here in, uh, believe in themselves. Anyways, <laughs> sorry about that. In himself. Okay, so that uh, if you want to say sí mismo, okay? Uh, if you want to say herself, en sí misma. Okay, she has, ella. Tiene que creer en sí misma. She has to believe in herself. Okay. Um, so, yeah. In this situation, well, this second example is a bit more complex. Uh, we have more. It's a long-ish long, long -ish, uh, phrase for sure. No puedo creer. I can't believe. Uh, que Miguel. No puedo creer que. I can't believe. Miguel. Miguel. Dijo que said no cree en sí mismo doesn't believe he doesn't believe in himself so what's up with that miguel come on come on miguel you can do it you should believe in yourself <laughs> okay so now you know that creer en sí mismo means to believe in oneself so feel free to use this phrase try try to practice your spanish um, you know, by using this interesting phrase. 